Here is a short video on how to modify your hang back filter. So the reason you may want to do this is because A, it can get expensive, buying those throwaway filters all the time. They are not reusable. I've tried. You rinse them out, you put them back, they're working. Day or two later, they clog up and you've got a mess on your hands. Also, they are filled with carbon most of the time. And while that's fine, but you may not want that if you have a planted tank and they, I mean, there's really no benefit to using that unless you're like trying to get medication out of your tank. So what you want to do is you want to take the old filter or the new filter, depending on how new your setup is. Take that and use that as like a guideline of where to cut your sponge. And you can get coarse sponge or fine sponge. You can use filter floss. I would recommend the coarse sponge just because it's easier to manage. It never clogs up and it does the job. So cut into a shape that will easily fit into your hang back filter. Make sure to rinse it out before you put it in. And then what you want to do from there is just fill in the open part of your filter. And you can just put like one in, have it open, or you can fill it like all the gaps. You can stick as much coarse sponge as you want. I do not recommend doing that with a finer, more dense sponge as you will definitely clog and end up with overflow issues. This is a pretty easy replacement to those throwaway filters and I do like that it saves me money in the long run. So when it comes time for maintenance, it's pretty easy. You just take some tank water, you pull out your sponge, and you rinse your sponge out in that tank water, whether you're doing water changes or just regular maintenance. Since I'm using coarse sponge, I usually don't have to do this, but maybe once a month at mats every other week. Here is my Aquia Clear 20. As you can see, it has bio rings and the filter that came with it. I just replaced the carbon with coarse sponge in the middle. And there you have it. If you enjoyed this video, give it a like, and if you have any questions, leave a comment. Take care and have a great day.